Hotep, my name is Lord Yukili Osai, and I'm broadcasting to you on behalf of 13 Cosmic Laws in Astrology. And um, today, I just want to um, talk to you real briefly about the weather. All right, I promised you that I was going to do a video discussing the weather and how the weather is real haywire and what's taking place, you know, in the atmosphere right here on Earth. So here it is. All right. Um, the weather is very uncontrollable. It's very unpredictable. I call it bipolar weather. One minute the sun is out, you know what I'm saying? Then the rain comes while the sun is out. Then the sun disappears and it storms and then it's hailing and then the sun comes out again. It's bipolar weather. It's like it hasn't made up its mind to stay consistent enough to show us, you know, okay, the seasons are, you know, the seasons, period. You know, see, we experience winter in the fall. We experience, you know what I'm saying, uh, uh, um, winter in the spring. And so it's all kind of things going on with this weather. And people continue to tell me, Lord, you kill your side. You need to do a video on the weather. Like, what, what is... 13 cosmic laws in astrology have to say about the weather and so this is my report about the re the weather and what's taking place now um ra talks about on um 13 signs in astrology ra talks about how um the uh the the weather the archons you know what i'm saying who who camouflage themselves as being an asian ones who are like extraterrestrial beings who he believes are responsible for creating this world are dictating the weather and they're the reason why the weather is like so bipolar right now right well i disagree with that all right i don't believe no archons is responsible for creating the weather and making the weather all fucked up i believe that the weather is a reflection of how you feel and it's in the weather is you know what I'm saying? Also, Mother Nature is 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 basically responding or react, mirroring or reflecting your thoughts and your feelings and your emotions and vibrating on those frequencies in a way that you begin to see the reflection of that, the, the, the external manifestations of what's taking place internally. So when you see the chaos and the weather and the bipolarness and the weather, that's all a reflection of what's taking place inside of you internally. You see what I'm saying? Everything externally and that we witness in our reality, you know what I'm saying, is predicated on what's taking place internally and what's taking place with us inside. You know what I'm saying? Our thoughts and our feelings and our emotions and what frequencies we're vibrating on. So fuck the archons, fuck the aliens, fuck all of that ancient one rhetoric, you know what I'm saying, bullshit. I don't believe it and I don't suggest that you believe it neither you know um, we're responsible for our own weather now um, I think it's interesting because in Ohio allegedly this DA have put up this groundhog prosecuted this groundhog and put the groundhog up put put the groundhog up for the death penalty because the groundhog was inaccurately predicting the weather you know what i'm saying and so the da got mad at that and felt offended and said well fuck it man you know you're not accurately predicted predicting this 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 weather you know i'm gonna i'm gonna prosecute your ass and, and actually put him up for you know allegedly put him up for the death penalty a groundhog or whatever you know what i'm saying for inaccurately creating you know news reports or whatever so what i want to tell you is that you have to stop watching the news, all right, and, and allowing them to define your reality. If you watch my, my videos, it's a four series videos, and I'm talking about changing realities, you will see that you have the power, right, to dictate your own reality, to create and define a reality for you that will allow you to feel, you know, happy and blissful, you know what I'm saying, as you exist. You see what I'm saying? So you have to stop Turn off the TV. Stop relying or counting on or depending on Channel 2 News, Channel 7 News, Channel 4, Channel 5 News to dictate your reality. You know what I'm saying? Why are you waiting for some man or some woman to get up there, you know what I'm saying, with their opinion of how the weather should be? And you're, and you're actually believing this shit. And you're actually living out this shit. You see what I'm saying? They can't predict no weather for you. You need to start predicting the weather for you. Stop. What I'm trying to get you to do is I'm trying to get you to wake up and come into this paradigm of changing realities and really changing them. You know what I'm saying? Really, really, really changing realities where you stop 
waiting on somebody else to define a reality for you and you start defining realities for yourself all right turn off the tv stop letting them tell lies to your vision because all they doing is up there and they trying to what basically what how it works is that they say all right today is going to be rent they forecast they do a seven day forecast right and the more people who watch the news and they believe that that's going to be the weather report for those seven days, they get energy and power behind those paradigms. And your thoughts, feelings, emotions, you know what I'm saying, and, and, and willpower is what allows that forecast to come to fruition and manifest itself in your in, as a reality, you know what I'm saying, that would define your existence. So that's how the weather becomes the weather report. When they say for the next seven days it's going to be sunny and, you know, it might be rainy on this day and all of that. If you enough people who watch that and believe that, then that will happen. You see what I'm saying? And so you have to you have to turn off the TV. And the reason why the weather is so bipolar right now is because the universe is waiting for you to anchor your own news, for you to break your own stories and 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 decide how you desire the weather to be. And that's what's taking place right now. You know what I'm saying? As this shift is taking place, there's a shift of consciousness, but there's also a shift of power. You know what I'm saying? The power is being removed from, you know what I'm saying, the anchor mans and the news reporters, and the power is now given to you. All right, you have the power. You know what I'm saying? That's right, I said it. Lord Yukili Osai has said it on 13 Cosmic Laws in Astrology that you, you have the power to forecast your own weather. Now, this is a practice that I've been doing all year long. I said that all this year, the sun is going to come out every day for me. Every day of the year, the sun is going to come out for me. I don't care if it's raining. The sun is still going to come out for me every single day. And there's been days where, you know, um, I've been challenged. You know, they thought that they, the Archon stat that they can challenge me by creating a little darkness in the skies and presenting that as a reality, thinking I was going to accept that. If you watch my video on changing realities, you will know that I have the power, you know what I'm saying, to change realities. You know what I'm saying? And that you also have that power to change realities. And I go and I list the process of how you can change your realities by using the power of your imagination. You know what I'm saying? By using the power of your words, by using the power of your feelings and emotions, and then your willpower. You know what I'm saying? And so I talked about changing realities and, and miracles and stuff like that and how to work miracles. That's a whole new paradigm, a portal, to, a portal of consciousness consciousness that I open up that I navigated for you you know what I'm saying as a more navigator and you know I'm trying to get as much people to come into this paradigm as possible to give energy to this paradigm so that you know what I'm saying we would simultaneously begin to change realities with just a thought with just a word with just a feeling with just an emotion with just a will you know what I'm saying without even having to go through so much you know what I'm talking about so you know I talked about you know are you really need to if you watch this video you need to watch the the seven the four videos Videos on changing realities so you will get a deeper perspective of what I'm talking about so lately right you know I was challenged by the archons they you know I told I said I declared I proclaimed I declared and I decreed that the Sun will come out every day of this year for me you know and every day of this year you know it's come out for me thus far you know what I'm saying believe me and it's been days when it's rained and I said nah fuck that you know it's cool it's the rain is cool but the Sun is still gonna come out for me because I declared that the Sun is gonna come out for me so so I got out the car, you know what I'm saying, and I had to yell at the sun and I said, son, come out for me now, you know what I'm saying, and then the sun didn't come out, right, so I just, I just went on one, I'm talking about, I just jumped up, heck a, heck a tall light, I just jumped up and I was like, son, come out for me, clouds, disappear, now, rain, disappear now son come out for me and i did this i continued this chant for about five minutes with everything inside of me i'm talking about i'm at the top of my lungs yelling from the from the depths of my soul until i changed the atmosphere and the sun came out the clouds disappeared the rain shut up and it was just crystal clear beautiful sky you know what i'm saying the sun was beaming, the birds came out, was chirping, it was beautiful how I changed that atmosphere. So, you know what I'm saying? 
And so the sun has been coming out every day of the year for me as above, so below. But as the shift is taking place, you know what I'm saying? What goes down on down here would dictate what's happening up there. You know what I'm saying? Because, you know, um, astrology teaches us that this is the microcosm. Cosm, uh, cosmic reality, you know what I'm saying? A reflection of what's taking place in the in the in, in the macrocosm, you know, cosmic reality, you know what I'm saying? Of what's taking place up there. So, you know, as above, so below, but what's down here is dictating up there now. This shift is taking place. We're going from third density earth to fourth density earth. And some people are coming into the fourth dimension, and then some people are being ushered into the fifth dimension. So there's a lot of things taking place right now now on this earth as the shift is taking place you have to understand it as this shift is taking place there's a shift of power or if the power is is from is being taken from the illuminati you know what i'm saying and and it's given to all those who are operating at the at the heart chakra level you know what i'm saying if you reach your heart chakra if you tapped into that vortex of energy that's dealing with your heart chakra then you know you're you're possibly going to make this shift you know what I'm saying? You're possibly going to make this shift. Now I don't want to just put that in stone and say you're going to make the shift because, you know, it's based on you. You can hold yourself back by believing that you're not worthy enough to make this shift. You know what I'm saying? And 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 that that will be your reality. You know, I'm not worthy enough to, to ascend. I'm not worthy enough to make this shift. And that can be your reality. You know what I'm saying? But this video is basically telling you that you need to start speaking. And, you know, uh, out of your mouth, you know what I'm saying, what the weather is going to be. You need to start defining that for yourself and stop allowing them to define that for you. You know what I'm saying? And 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 so, you know, that's what this video is about. Now, now, let me show you something right quick. Let me show you something right quick. Teach you a little bit about you know these cosmic laws and shit where everything is. This my chakra man board might appear a little weird to you because you know uh, I didn't design it so that you can see it in the matrix right. But the root chakra right, the root chakra is right here. It's found in your body, located at the root of your spine, right? And that root chakra is dealing with grounding. Um, it's dealing with your stability, it's dealing with your physical needs, it's dealing with your security, it's dealing with your survival, your ability to manifest things, it's dealing with the material world and material gain and stuff like that. You know what I'm saying? Your sacral chakra is dealing with your emotions, your relationships with people, your sexuality, your self-worth, your confidence, your creativity, and your empathy, right? The solar plex is dealing with your personal power, your willpower, your energy, your metabolism, your effectiveness in life, your self-esteem, your social identity, and your happiness. All right. Your heart chakra is dealing with your love, with your understanding, with trust, you know what I'm saying, with hope, with openness, with compassion, with balance, with forgiveness. Your throat chakra is dealing with communication, your ability to communicate, your sound, your vibration, your self-expression, your listening, your listening, speaking, and writing abilities. You know what I'm saying? The third eye is dealing with your physical abilities, your your uh, channeling abilities, your t telepathic abilities, your astral traveling, your visions, your your connection to your higher self. You know what I'm saying? And then your crown chakra is dealing with universal consciousness, all-knowing cosmic connection. You know what I'm saying? The God source. You know what I'm saying? Which I call vanity energy or vine or source energy, vine energy. You know what I'm saying? It's dealing with enlightenment. It's dealing with the gateway to other dimensions. All right. Well, the reason why there's a shift in, in power taking place is because the Illuminati and different lower entities are only at operating or at the sacral. Sh uh, uh, sacral chakra level, you know what I'm saying? They because they gave up their soul, so they're only stuck with emotions, relationships, sexuality, self work, creativity, and empathy. They're in that vortex. They made it to the heart vortex, dealing with love, understanding, trust, hope, openness, compassion, balance, and forgiveness. See what I'm saying? They lack forgiveness and all of that other shit. So they're not going to make this shift. Anyone who's operating at the heart chakra has the ability to make this shift. So, you know, now you need to start basically paving, you know, blazing your own trails, navigating your own area in space. You know what I'm saying? So you 
You formulate your own weather reports. You dictate the weather and stop letting them dictate the weather. You know, and that's basically what I'm going to tell you. Fuck the aliens and fuck the news. Turn that shit off. If you want it to rain, declare it. You know what I'm saying? If you want it to sun, the sun to come out, decree it. Period.